Imagine you create a bank account, then decide to delete all your information and set up a new account with the same bank. Even though you've removed your details, the bank systems can still recognize that you're the same person. The same applies to Etihad. Their recruitment systems are sophisticated and they can track when someone has multiple accounts. When you create multiple accounts after being rejected, you risk being blacklisted. This means you could permanently lose your chance of ever getting that dream job with Etihad. Instead of rushing to reapply, it's crucial to respect the cooling off period, which is usually three or six months. Now you might be thinking, what should I do during this waiting period? Well, use this time wisely. Reflect on the stage where you were eliminated and work on improving in that area. If it was your interview, practice your answers and build your confidence. Trust me, taking this time to prepare will increase your chances of success in your next application. I've also received a lot of questions from you all about whether you can delete your applications or profiles to start fresh. Unfortunately, there's no way to delete your profile or applications once they've been submitted. Some people ask if the recruitment team can do it for you. While I'm not certain about that, you can always email them and ask. The good news? Etihad is known for their responsiveness, which is one of the reasons I love them. And they always reply to all the inquiries, however, it will take some hours before they reach out. Remember, they receive over a thousand emails daily. Before we wrap up, let's go through some additional information you should know. Etihad doesn't accept applications via email. You'll need to apply through their careers website. Once your application review is complete, Etihad's team will update your online status and notify you via email. Please be patient as this process can take time due to the high volume of applications. I have done a video on the video introduction video so make sure to watch it. I will attach it at the end of this video I have shared the questions asked and the sample answers. Remember this is the first formal step so make sure you're comfortable and confident.